while learning technical analysis you must have come across these type of patterns so they are most commonly found in the stocks so they are called as pole and flag so initially in this there is an aggressive move and then there is a consolidation period so initial aggressive move is called as pole and the consolidation is called as flag there are two types of flag one is bullish flag and second one is bearish flag the entry criteria in this pattern is break of flag trend line and stop loss will be the low of the flag two types of targets can be expected in this pattern measure the length of flag and add it to the entry that will be your conservative target more aggressive target can be compute the total length of the pole and add it to the entry so that will be your total pole length target to have more accuracy with this pattern do look at divergence gaps and volume example of this can be here there was a negative divergence so price was ready to fall then there was a gap to break the flag if you plot fibonacci on pole then you will see that flag will not go beyond 0.3 to fibonacci thanks for watching bye bye